Hello everyone and welcome to episode 1 of season 2 of my LEGO custom creation series. I have now decided to build things from video games as well as animals. Today I have decided to build 3 things from one of my favourite games, Team Fortress 2. First up we have the Engineer Sentry Gun. Now despite me doing loads of videos before this, most of them being builds of animals, this just might be one of my most complicated builds yet. This is because all of my builds so far have been have been focusing on a certain structure in which I just start with a body, then some legs, and they're all built the same way. However, this one I had to experiment with a load of different bricks, such as these ones with holes in them and these. Yeah, so I needed to try out something new and yeah, I went through so many previous versions of this before I finally settled with the final version. What I really wanted to get out of the sentry gun is what it really does in the game, and when it's body, only this bit can spin around. But I'm afraid that it can't do it, otherwise it would look terrible with a load of... a lot more things here, which you wouldn't need. So I think that this, this one looks like what it's supposed to look like, but doesn't necessarily have all the functions. Also, uh, these bits right here, I couldn't actually find pieces which would look like these. So I had to paint some paper black, then I had to cut that out and tape it on in a certain way, which... The tape's kind of annoying, but I like the look of it otherwise. This bit on the back can also be taken away from the black stand, and I just broke it. Um, you can see kind of how this, or the hole here, connects to there. And, yeah, I think this is all there is to the sentry gun. So next up we have the engineer's dispenser. Now, unlike the sentry gun, which I, I'm perfectly happy with the sentry gun, this one, I think it looks half good, half terrible. Because, for example, I really like this bit, and I really like this bit here, and this bit, but for example, this bit, I, I just can't find a better piece, but I... I this bit's terrible, it's just terrible. Um, this bit kind of just holds weapons. I can just put guns in there, because that's what it does in the game. And I really had to look at this one to get it right. Well, it was actually the same with the sentry gun, but this one I never actually looked at what the Spencers look like in the game, so... Yeah, now I know what they look like, and I think this one turned out quite good. It's alright, I guess. Lastly, I have built a minifigure of the Sniper and two weapons which you can get for him in the game. The minifigure itself is made out of mostly random pieces. I don't know where most of them come from. Well, I know that this is from a Lego movie set, the cowboy hat. And this is from a Lego minifigure, so the arms. But I don't know where these two pieces come from. I think that this might be a pirate's body and... I don't know, they're just completely random pieces and there really isn't much to it. It's just... It just kind of looks like the sniper, kind of, if you use your imagination. You can also make him hold a bow, which is one of the weapons which he has in the game. And finally, what would a sniper minifigure be without his most famous or infamous weapon? The Gerati. Now, for those of you who don't know, uh, Gerati is a jar of, well, urine, which he throws at people. What a good, what, what a good game. Wow. Wow, congratulations Valve, you've made a good game, wow. Yeah, so I think that this is just about everything from my LEGO Team Fortress 2 video. In case you're wondering why it's so short, it's because I've realised how long and boring my older LEGO videos were. Uh, for example, some of them, like the panda one, went on for over 8 minutes, because I just kept talking about one thing for so long. And, yeah, just like I've mentioned, from now on I won't only be making animals, I'll also be making things from games. So, yeah, uh, Hang on, what's this? No way. It's an RPG. You know who else has an RPG? Gordon Freeman. Looks like in the next video, I'll be building something from...